Hey guys, Marilyn and Teresa here. We are here for her celebration and we're wearing our crown and tiara. So thanks for joining us. Oh, look, there's Jill. Oh, hey. And there's Lisa. Hey guys. Say hello to everybody. It's This is a talkie. Say hello. Hi. Hey. Hello. <laughs> Wait, it's not a silent movie? No, it's it's a it's a talkie. So it's yeah, Teresa's it's 60th birthday, and she has red. So Teresa's 60th. There's Jill, and there's Lisa. Thanks, guys. Bye. Hello, hello. Marilyn with Shady and Y here. This is my friend Teresa, and she found this magnificent jewelry picture. Where did you find this, Teresa? Lucky me, at one of my local thrift shops. Nice. Stay tuned. Let's see what's in the jewelry a picture. Hello again. All right, so Teresa got this for $19.99. Some shells. And pearls. Every jewelry jar must have pearls. And a watch. I am excited to see it. There we go. That's the jewelry jar. There you go. All right. What do you think, guys? We have a lot of bangles. We'll just pull those out first. Um, so red silver green gold and there's a lot of them one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty one so if anybody's interested in 21 bangles let's just do two dollars okay let's see we have a empty bag we have, oh, look, we have um, anchor um, earrings. earrings. They're post earrings, gold tone. I'm going to say a dollar because they're fabric and um, very lovely. All right, we have a stretch bracelet. Um, no missing rhinestones. It has a little tone loss. Um, let's just say $2, but that is nice. It has some stretch lock. Okay, let's say a dollar for craft. <laughs> I just broke. Uh, okay, so this is craft for a dollar. I have the peanut gallery sitting with me, so if y'all hear anything in the background now, you know. Um, I don't. I think Cub Scouts is that what that is? So a little Cub Scout. Okay, so Cub Scout center thing. So that's a dollar. Weeblow. Weeblow Scouts. Okay, so this huh. red and blue beaded necklace with some gold. Um, it does not have a name, so we're just gonna say $2. And we have some, oh wait, 22. 22. <laughs> <laughs> um, some Mardi Gras beads, a dollar. Oh wait, this goes with the other Mardi Gras beads, so that's $2, I mean $1 for each of them. Both of them together, $1. Mm. Oh look, oh my gosh, I almost thought we had a tiara, but <gasps> Oh, it is. Oh. It's like a little. Tiara. It's a baby tiara. Baby. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's missing some rhinestones, but you can replace the rhinestones. But you got to keep that. 
All right, Teresa is keeping this adorable baby tiara. Is that not the cutest thing? I just want y'all to know, this is the first time I've ever seen a baby tiara. That's sweet. That is nice. And that goes to Teresa. She's not selling that. Oh, how adorable. All right, here we have, I, oh, there we go. I was about to say it was broken, but I think it is, no, it's just, a blue statement necklace. It's um, just two-tone blue. And um, let's say, let's say $2 for this one. It looks like enamel, nice. We have a cuff bracelet. This one is signed. This is a Chico's cuff bracelet. It needs to be cleaned. Um, okay, uh, let's say it just needs a little bit of cleaning on the inside, but the outside looks actually pretty good. It just needs to be polished up. So I'm going to say, that's pretty cool. Let's say $5. Here we have, um, another bracelet. This one is signed. Uh, this one is a faux Cartier. Um, yeah, it's missing the center lock mm -hmm. mechanism um, that looks like this, but you know it's faux. One, because of the weight of it, um, you would, if it was Cartier, it's automatically has a weight to it that this doesn't have. So we're just gonna put this in craft for a dollar. We have, um, some faux pearls. And anytime you have faux pearls, um, remember you have little girls who love to play with them. These are completely faux, um, completely plastic. But we have three pairs of them. They're long and they're complete plastic. They don't bend, because if I bend them, they're gonna break. A yellow pair, a white pair, and another. So I'm just gonna say a dollar for the three. This is pretty cool. This is that new, um, I think this is a statement necklace. It could be, hmm. Um, this is missing the, um, uh, one side to it. So this is gonna go in craft, but this has got some great pieces to rework. So um, we're just gonna say a dollar for craft, but this is a great workable piece with lots of nice rhinestones mm -hmm. and beads and acrylic um, pieces. We have a watch. It is by Geneva. It's elite. It needs a battery, so let's just say um, $4. Here we have a shell necklace that is really cool. Is it shells or is it, no, this is nuts. And it's cream color with bl a light blue wash, but these are really nice. It's also white. So I'm gonna say, those are nice, so let's say $2. Ooh, look at that lovely thing. We have no signature. It is about a size seven and a half. It's no missing rhinestones. So I'm gonna say $10, nice. Here we have a rhinestone. Uh, it's missing one of the rhinestones, but that is a nice little piece. Uh, this is missing a rhinestone, so let's just say putting it in craft for a dollar. Here we have a very stretched out um, shell, um, lacquered shell bracelet. So let's just say four dollars. 
but it's very nice. It's actually not that stretched out, um, so it's actually very nice. There you go. Oh, look, here's the other part of that piece that was broke, so we'll add this to that one. This goes with something, so we have two here. We have a Alex and Ani, and it, ah, uh, hmm, look, it says to the moon and back, just needs to be cleaned up a little bit. So I think this one's not for sale. Teresa has this thing for the moon and stars. That's why we're having a Zen birthday weekend. Here we have, are these missing? Yes, okay. Here is a, um, oops, um, lots of rhinestones missing, but it's a great little piece to work with. So we're just gonna say a dollar for the necklace and the pendant. You didn't want that, did you? Another watch. It's no name watch. Um, yeah, so just a dollar. Another quartz, no name. We'll go with a dollar. Oh, here's one of those weird things. I don't, does any, if anybody knows what this is, because there's so many of them out there, it's completely rubberized and there's no separation in it. Is there a reason for this? If there is, leave it in the comments, please, because I see these all the time and they're just strange to me. Um, this is a leather bracelet with a lobster clasp with rhinestones on it. And there's no missing rhinestones. So I'm gonna say $2 on this one. Here we have a major statement. Um, it's discolored throughout the gold. So it has pieces that would actually be nice to reuse. So I'm just gonna say a dollar. Ah, oh, look, this must be, is there some kind of woofy thing? <laughs> I think that's the cub. The this other one was a wee blow. Let's just say $2 on this one also. This, oh, isn't that so sweet? It's a copper bracelet that says Big Sister with a heart. And um, that's nice. Um, okay, then I'm gonna say, let's do $7. Nice. Here we have an adjustable bracelet that is gold and white. And it is adjustable, just pull the ends. So let's just say $2. This is just too cute. It's a Christmas stretchy bracelet with charms. And you've got bells and you've got Santa Claus and wreaths and snowmen. Oh, these are adorable. The stretch is really loose on this. Um, but I'm gonna say I'm gonna say $7 for this. So this is a really good one, guys. It's got enamel charms on it, so nice. Okay, so I'm gonna say that it is um, um, little acrylic pieces, so I'm gonna say a dollar. Um, we have, is this a Betsy Johnson? Um, there's no signature on this, but this is so Betsy Johnson-like. It's crazy. Um, you've got the sugar skull with the pink bow. You got the lips. You've got the heart with wings. You got a key. You have the Betsy Johnson roses that could be, I would say, um, this is really, really nice. If we were to sell this, I'm going to put it at $25. So if anybody's interested, let me know. And this is a Jessica Simpson piece. She does like her chains. Um, it's chain tassel wrapped. So if anybody's interested, let's say $4. There you go. Oh, look how nice. 
I don't even have to ask, but this one goes to Teresa. It is Breast Cancer Awareness, and we are very, very lucky to have Teresa be a survivor of breast cancer. So this stays with Teresa. Let's see if I can, oh, look. What number were we on? 22. 22. 23. 24? 23 and 24. Mm -hmm. yeah. So these go with the previous one. Check it out. Oh, there went a bead. And here we have one earring that is a snake. It is missing. I don't think it's missing any rhinestones, but it's a snake and it's just one. So let's just say $1. We have two singles. So a dollar piece. Okay, one single and it's a dollar piece. <laughs> and I think this is, I'm not sure what this is, but it's kind of cool because it has little flowers on it that are really cool. So let's say um, $4. And then this is Um, let's see what, oh, Eureka, we have a snake earring. So we have a set of earrings that are the two snakes and those are cute as can be. So we're, what did I say that was? Now it's $5 for the pair because that's cute and no missing rhinestones. And then this is a tassel. Um... Oh, that's pretty. These are roses with a gold tassel. The, um, is that? Yeah, it's in really good condition. There's no wear. So I'm just gonna say, let's do, um, let's do $4. This one is, I think we have, I have no idea what we have. What is it? It's just a tassel. So we have a tassel and we're gonna say $2. So what did you think of our jewelry jar? Not too bad. So if you saw anything that you liked, definitely give us a um, email to mhl22 at ymail.com. Anything under a pound in the United States is $5. Anything over a pound or outside the United States is based on where you live and how much it weighs. Yes. Thank you for spending a little bit of your day with us. We appreciate you and we will see you on the next one. Bye.